This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello there, I'm Virginia Chow with this ABC 10 News update. Governor Newsom has signed a climate package that seeks to tackle environmental changes that contribute to destructive wildfires. The $15 billion package invests almost $4 billion in putting more zero emissions vehicles on the road and $5.2 billion to address drought. It also promotes clean energy efforts and wildfire preparedness. Police have now identified the man who was shot and killed by an officer in Escondido Friday night. Escondido police say it started when 38-year-old Jonathan Carroll randomly shot at a car with a man and a teenager inside earlier in the day. They say an officer later spotted Carroll and when he attempted to pull him over, Carroll sped away. Police say Carroll eventually got out of his car and shot at the officer twice. The officer was not hurt. He has been placed on administrative leave as this investigation continues. A reminder to bring your patients with you if you're planning to enjoy restaurant week. Many restaurants don't have enough staff to serve all the people expected quickly. So they're hoping during restaurant week some visitors might see these restaurants not only as good places to eat, but also good places to work. You can check out the list of participating locations on our website, 10news.com. Restaurant week starts Sunday morning. Let's talk about this Friday forecast as we head into the weekend, Megan. And we have some big changes. So not only tracking the cool down, it will be about 3 to 10 degrees cooler today with 70s and 80s for most of the county and 90s in the deserts, but also monsoon moisture. So this afternoon and evening, isolated to scattered rain and thunderstorms is expected anywhere in the county. So stay weather aware today. Those thunderstorms are going to form quickly. And of course, if you hear thunder roar, head indoors. We'll keep a slight chance through Sunday, though the better chance tomorrow and Sunday will be near the mountain and desert areas. It's not out of the question to see them spill over to the valleys, but it's not as likely. Temperatures are going to drop not only through the weekend and into next week. In fact, most of the county next week will be in the 70s. Virginia. Thank you so much, Megan. For the latest news, weather and traffic, just go to 10news.com or you can download our free app from your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Virginia Cha.